Hi there, good morning. Uh, in this video, I'll be sharing with you about how to pitch a dome tent. Okay, so in this example, I have a bag of a four man tent. Okay, four man dome tent. So let's look at the contents of the main tent. We have the main tent itself, and this is the fly sheet. The fly sheet acts as a um, protection against rain. And we have a bag of 10 poles. So inside the 10 pole bag, you would normally find three sets of poles. Okay, you will find a shorter set of pole. This one will be just for the fly sheet, or what we call the fly sheet pole. And then you will also find two sets of poles which are identical. So I've got one set here and I've got another set right over here. So three sets of poles, two long and one short pole. So you can call this the main tent pole and this will be the fly sheet pole. Alright, next part will be the uh, bag of 10 packs and the guidelines. So what are 10 packs? It's basically this metal hooks that you're going to use to secure your tent to the ground and sometimes in your pack you also be given guideline for you to secure to tie the tent to the tent packs okay so let's just put everything aside first we're going to begin with the main tent itself So you just saw me open up the main tent and at each corner of the main tent normally you will see a metal ring okay, and a metal pin. Okay, these two items must be, must be present at each corner of your tent okay, because this pin is what's going to hold your, your, your main tent poles. Okay? I'm going to get the 10 poles right so what I do is that I do not fix my poles straight away I'll just get one end of the main 10 pole And I'm going to fit this tent pole into the sleeve on the roof of the main tent. So as I push the tent pole into the sleeve, I will then assemble the pole uh, Concurrently. So, if you can see right at the end over here, I'm holding on to the uh, pin at the corner of the tan. I'll put the pin inside the metal sleeve here. Okay secure one end of the main tent pole into the uh, tent. Next, I'm going to fix a second pole. So as you can imagine, the poles will run like a, like a letter X.
I'll put the pin inside. Okay. So at this stage is where you will bend the poles. And once one of the ten pole is bended, I will then secure it with a pin. So we are almost there with the main tent. Don't forget to secure the black hooks that attaches the main tent to the pole itself. Spend some time to adjust the, the door of the tent. So, normally, most tents nowadays you can easily just pull or roll the door or the window and then just hook it up with this uh, plastic hook that will just secure. Oops. They will just secure the door uh, nicely. Okay. So right now I'm going to show you how you how you fix the the fly sheet. So the fly sheet is almost like a rectangular shape. Okay. So you can imagine that there are four corners. What's important is that at the bottom side of the, of the fly sheet, you will see a black pocket for you to hook up the fly sheet pole. Okay, so you got the fly sheet ready. And we're just gonna swing it over the main tent itself. Alright, we are done with the tent. Um, this is just a basic way of securing the, of pitching your tent. Um, 
if you like to make your tent a bit more secure, you can make, you will need at least four tent packs for you to secure the tent to the ground. Okay? Because sometimes when, it's, uh, when there's a strong gust of wind, uh, it may just blow your tent away. So I'm going to show you how you actually secure the tent packs and I'm going to bring you for a close-up look in, at the different parts of the tent uh, for you to have a bigger, pic, better picture of the tent itself. So this is the corner of the tent. In case you miss out, this black hook comes from the main from the ply sheet and you simply hook up to the metal ring at the leg of the tent. Okay? Quite a straightforward. If the bungee cord is uh, slightly long, you can actually uh, pull it out away from the tent. Okay, that will increase the gap between your tent and the fly sheet, which will then give you a higher chance of staying dry in case it rains. As for the tent pack, alright, this is a tent pack. You basically put the tent pack through the metal ring and make sure that you it goes in 45 degrees to the ground and towards the middle of the tent okay do the same for all the corners if the ground is a bit soft or relatively soft you can just use your hand uh, to push in sometimes there may be a rock underneath so you will need either a mallet or uh, some rocks around the area to use as a hammer okay so basically that is it for the corners of the tent A bit of housekeeping. You will put all your spare equipments inside the tent bag. Okay, and then make sure you zip it up. You don't want to lose all these small parts. Uh, and then on the last day before you leave the campsite, you realize everything is missing. Okay, in the tent itself. Okay, you will see that there is uh, normally a bag hanging on the right and left. So you could use these bags or, or pockets and just stuff your tent bag inside so that it doesn't go missing. Okay, so there we have it a simple four man dome tent. Okay, so have fun pitching the tent and have a good time camping.